did we go come in at? Down Where's the main gate? O'Brien gate. Okay. No, we came in. So that's the live sock, right? We yeah. were just there. Right now we're right here. Down. Would you ride on those up there? No. At the top? No. no? Why not? Why not? The kids, they really loved stopping by to learn about how to milk some camels. But really, Crow, what did you want to do? Just go to the petting zoo. Now, there's no milk. And when I look at the teats, there's nothing. In a moment, they're going to start filling up and filling up. There you go. So now they're getting bigger and they're getting bigger. Like they really swell up. No, back here. It just shoved the other guy out of the way. I want to touch that pig. Here, eat it. You don't want any? Okay, you eat some. I want to bring one home too. <laughs> whoa, whoa, watch me! <laughs> oh, you got horns. rides and the really spinny ones. Didal almost lost his bait. Crow and Tadi went on all the slow kid rides. Kid rides? They're family rides and we got ice cream too. I had really good Oreo churros. What was better, Crow? Ice cream. Ice cream. <laughs> Had the most fun. Uh, Who is the most tired? Uh, My feet. Are Who My has feet the are best killing. desserts? Uh, I had the best dessert. Went on the most fun rides. Us. 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 Us, us for sure. Us for sure. All right, us. fine. The only one I can win. Who's the oldest? <laughs> that guy. <laughs> Who wanted to take home the sheep? That guy. Probably her too. No, come on. We all want to take home that little baby goat. I mean, yeah. That little white yeah. one was so okay, yeah. cute. Who wishes they would have won one of those? Me. 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 One of those sloths? They're, they're, uh, massive. they're so big. Who's glad that we didn't win one of those giants? Us. <laughs> How dare you. Lately, we've really been focusing on balance in our family, uh, which is why we felt it was a great time to partner with Pride Counseling. So thank you for supporting our channel. And when I say balance, I mean taking time out to do the things that are actually important, uh, like going to the fair, taking our kids to the fair, and having a beach day, or having a day outside playing in the yard or the baseball park. It's so easy to fall into our routine of hustle. Life gets hectic for all of us and we are really working on that balance. Because without that balance, I start to feel like my mental health is suffering. And mental health is so important because it allows us to show up for ourselves, but also the people that we love. Pride Counseling will assess your needs and match you with your own licensed professional therapist who has relevant expertise, experience, and trained to provide therapy for LGBTQ plus community members. Then you can talk to your therapist however you feel comfortable, whether it's via chat, 
text, phone, or video call. You can message your therapist at any time and schedule live sessions whenever it's convenient for you. And if your therapist isn't right for any reason, you can switch to a new therapist at no additional charge. With Pride Counseling, you get the same professionalism and quality you expect from in-office therapy, but with a therapist who is custom picked for you, more scheduling flexibility, and at a more affordable price. If you're feeling like the time is right and you're ready to join us on our mental health journey, visit pridecounseling.com slash blue to get 10% off your first month. Today is the day. I'm about to jump into this project, try not to get in my head about it because I've, I've taken on this job a couple times in the past. It's not my favorite job to do, but the end goal is gonna be worth it, so I'm willing to take it on with, uh, what's the word that I'm looking for? Just uh, a positive attitude, I guess? Today I'm sanding down the floors in what will become our primary bedroom. It also only has a half bath, has a toilet and sink. Eventually, we will expand this bathroom and add a shower, add a proper vanity, and kind of fill it out. Today our goal is just to clean up the floors because they're stinky. Um, they're concrete floors, which is why it's so echoey, so sorry for that, that's just the way it is. My favorite feature of this space is the French doors that open up into the backyard where we have potential for a lawn or a really nice landscape, gravel, plants, couches, vibe. Also, a massive maple tree, huge canopy of shade. And off in the distance, you can hear the wild peacocks. That's what they sound like. I'm so looking forward to waking up to these French doors, to the outside, and that being the first thing I see, besides my husband's lovely face. Let's come along. Let's we'll see how this goes today. That was a long day. The room already smells better. It just smells wet, but it doesn't smell like animal urine. And uh, I feel like we're that much closer to making that room feel like home. 